Okay, so this is a really fundamental question that I get asked. A lot of people out there think the answer is obvious, but there's also a lot of confusion about this. The question is, what is the difference between a solar hot water panel and a solar electricity panel? Completely different things, okay? A solar hot water panel typically looks like this. Uh, that one's got an integrated tank, so um, it stores the water on the roof with the panel. You can also get them without the tank, the tanks where the tank's on ground level, it looks like this. Um, and how these panels work is it's really simple. You pump cold water literally through the panel. The sun comes in, hits the glass, hits the water, heats the water, the sun's heat heats the water, uh, and the hot water gets pumped to your hot taps. Simple as that. Um, there's two main types of technology for solar hot water panels. And uh, you've just seen the flat plate collector because they're a flat plate. There's also a funkier looking technology. Um, I really, I get into all sorts of trouble with solar hot water dealers if I say it's more efficient. And they look like this, it's an evacuated tube. Um, they're more expensive, uh, you can see why, they look a lot more um, intricate to make. And generally they convert more of the sun's heat into heat in the water, hence why they're more efficient, um, certainly more efficient at lower temperatures. So if you live somewhere chilly, like uh, Melbourne or you know, Tasmania, <laughs> you're probably looking at evacuated tubes. If you, know, if you live somewhere like Brisbane, like northern New South Wales, evacuated tubes are probably a bit over the top. Okay, so that's a solar hot water panel. The second type of solar panel is the more common type of solar panel that people think about when they think about solar. That's the solar electricity panel. Typically looks like this. You get between six and 60 um, on a roof. They're much smaller than solar hot water panels. And all they do is they take the sunlight in. They use a mixture of semiconductors and um, silicon to convert the sunlight into electricity. So you get sunlight in, electricity out. Another uh, common question when we're talking about hot water and solar electricity is which type should you get first? Okay, really simple answer to that question. It depends how you heat your water at the moment. If you use electricity to heat your water, get solar hot water first. Um, the payback will be between five and six years and that will probably be a faster payback than solar electricity which will be between six and ten years. So get solar hot water first if you have um, an electric hot water system at home. If you have a gas hot water system at home, then it's uh, completely the other way around. Uh, gas heats water really efficiently anyway, so solar hot water, it will make it more efficient, but the payback, if you're retrofitting it, will probably be 15 to 20 years. Whereas if you get a PV system, the payback will be between six and 10 years. So that's the difference between solar hot water and solar PV, and the answer to the question, which should you get first?